Welcome back, Cave Dwellers. My name is K Dub, also known as the 417 Manchild, and we are in the 417 Manchild Cave. Uh, you can find me over on Instagram under the 417 Manchild. Uh, give me a follow, give me some likes, comment in there if you like what I'm doing. Uh, same thing here. You know, follow me, subscribe. Um, sorry, that's why I'm have to subscribe, not following. You know what I'm talking about. But, um, give me some likes and give me some uh, comments let me know what you like what you don't like am I doing stuff right am I doing it wrong just kinda let me know uh, today we're gonna be looking at a spawn dark ages figure and uh, it is the spellcaster so this one's pretty cool uh, we'll see on the back we got the horrid which is really freaking cool. I wish I had that. Uh, the Raider. Oh, sorry. The Horrid. The Raider I do have. There's the Spellcaster. Looks like it's got a variant. The Org, which is really cool. Uh, the Skull Queen. I think I've been low key looking for her and then spawn the Black Knight. It's freaking awesome. And of course, we have Psycho Circus um, Kiss figures, which I have all of those. I have those still on card. I've not opened them. So it looks like a couple things to remember while we're doing this. Left hand holds weapon is shown. Uh, to move creature's jaw up and down, pull and push the horn with your finger. So it looks like there's a especially thing. Looks like he hangs off one of the wings there. That's fun. So the heap, I have both the variant and the regular of the heap. I've been looking for the Creech. Um, he's pretty cool looking. A uh, reanimated spawn I do have from back in the day. Spawn four. I think I've did him on here. If not, I've got him. And then I do have a side gore to open, not this one, but I do have one to open. Looks like do, 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 do. that's the spawn club stuff. Let's see what it says over here. 1998 McFarlane. So this one's not in as good a shape, so this won't break anybody's heart if I open it. I mean I would anyways. I don't care if it was mint on card. But uh, that's just how I roll. Stand that up back there. And we will... Oh. All the twisty ties, kids. I don't see those very often in the unboxing. So let's go ahead and get untwisty tied. Get to that little tricky fella there. So as you remember, if you watch a needs in order... The thing I always talk about with 30 year old figures came true. I snapped the arm off of one of the spawn, the zombie spawn. So, okay, Dub, the old 417 man child here, is going to be a little more careful. I was a little bit too zippity doo dah with my stuff because it was warm and I didn't think I had to worry about that even though I constantly am telling everybody to be careful about that so let's get everything out and about I like the little minions some of the other ones come with various minions they're all really cool okay that's in there with tape oh, watched Encanto last night weird thing to mention here but so I've got to talk about Bruno stuck in my head the kids and wife love that show so that's I almost started singing it just now all right lots of, I like when spawn figures come with wings they're usually really really well detailed they, they make them really fun all right let us see let's scoot that up a little bit let's lower it down a little little skosh little skosh bit and let's take a look at some of the accessories let's take a 
Well, let's take a look. What will we take a look at? First, let's take a look at the axe. That is a fun, well detailed. Got the skull, got the rivets. I mean, McFarlane's stuff, I mean, he's always knocked it out of the block. Just incredible. There's a little minion guy. I'm looking at you. Uh, so he, yes, is articulated with these two hands. Not with the feet, not with anything else, but the arms, I mean, are articulated head, too. Oh, check that out. Hmm. You're talking to me? You're talking to me? Um, Betty doesn't stand. Nope. <laughs> the minions rarely do. But... Let's see here. Uh, there a picture? Where am I looking? I can't see. Looks like the these. Wow. Well, okay. First of all, let's just take a look at this thing. Okay. Let's just take a look at this thing. Okay. So that shiny green up there. This will move. Just be very careful, as I've shown you. And that even feels like it. if I go too far, it'll snap. But it does move. The head, head looks like it will move, but I'm not going to push nothing. This does not move. It moves a little, but I'm not going to push it. Look at that. Like the lizard tail with the legs turning into that that skull detail and that is killer the body the skull in there this thing's awesome i did not realize how cool it was there's a better look at the tail with the legs coming up man this thing's cool spine going up through there the back of this creature so let's put some wings on it looks like they curve in is it am I correct in thinking that the inside of the wings go like that maybe uh, the pointies go the wings out there are different than the wings here they're more splayed out so let's a lot of times and you'll notice with McFarlane stuff is the openings so if you can see the openings are smaller this one's smaller than this one this is more right are more I mean it's rectangular but closer to square than that is so let's see this is small so this will go up here like that and I think is I mean are you, that thing is awesome look at that detail okay so that's the horn that it said to open up so that is a detail that is awesome okay so this one's chunkier so that one goes on here and then it kind of wraps around like that god dang that is cool so this little guy likes to hang off of stuff i kind of want him no no he could hang off there or he could hang off like as I'm missing thing. I'm sitting here playing, you people are watching me play. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, again, I'm working on a very old toy. I wish the wrist moved because this is kind of weird. Like you could probably put him like this. Just hanging off. I like that. That's cool. I like that the oh looks like the leg moves sorry as you can see what I did with him holding him sorry I'm playing I'm not watching the screen I'm, I apologize for that but uh, yeah so that moves to give him make him stand so he bends at the knee oh his knee bends too so does no that one been side to side that's freaky i dig it all right buddy back up there i liked you up there like that ah, hold on 
on to it. I'm a minion. Um, I don't see where this goes. There's literally... Okay, that looks like that goes into a, the hand. So this is some kind of a blade. I'm confused, kids. That goes into... Left hand holds weapon as shown. So that twist... Oh, God, that makes me nervous. Ugh. All right, you can stay out there for a minute. I'm going to look. It says it holds it like this, I guess. Okay. Left hand holds that like that, which is weird, but... Ah. And then I'm still like you up here, bud. I can't help it. Still like you up here, bud. Been watching too much Letter Kenny. Uh, so that can go out like that. This does not have a little thing that normally they will plug into, but here is this. So, I mean, just detailed like crazy. Got the green to match the skull. God, that's cool. I don't know unless, I mean, it doesn't move. Ugh. After breaking the other one, I'm afraid. Ugh. That made me that made me throw up in my mouth a little bit but all right so we can put maybe that like so yeah we'll move that out of the way get that more of a background like that and this has nowhere to go so you'll find with the McFarlane stuff that uh, Sometimes they send stuff that had, won't go in the figure's hands. So, I I mean, this is clearly part of him because it matches this. But this is a wild card piece. And I don't see anywhere to store it. So, I will check that out later, maybe. It doesn't have a peg. doesn't have a hand to grip it. Maybe, he, maybe it's his weapon. that all right your weapon it is my man give him hell I bet that is his weapon <laughs> that's cool and then that can sit inside there like this maybe let's put it up a little more all right we'll fudge with that and see what happens all right well there you go kids be sure and like and subscribe um, give me uh, follow you know like I said subscribe tell your friends about me let me know let's build up some numbers let's have some fun with this thing and uh, go over on Instagram to 417 Manchild like my stuff there and uh, yeah there you go cool beans I like it so uh, follow me over there and give me likes and stuff over there and uh, be careful with these 30 year old figures they will break but man Todd McFarlane makes some amazing stuff here so uh, until next time uh, happy toy hunting and everybody be good to one another bye